High Court Judge Justice Joel Ngugi has been accused of blocking a private developer from accessing his property in Lavington Estate in Nairobi County. The director of uh, Guangzhou Villas Limited, Julius Opio, claims Justice Ngugi and residents of Oryx Villas have continued to stop his workers from accessing the site despite intervention by Nairobi County officials. Justice Ngugi and his partners claim they own the land. Justice Joel Ngugi's official car parked behind Rabo at Oryx Villas in Lovington Estate. The car in question said to have been parked by Justice Ngugi's driver earlier today when a contractor sent by the director of Guangzhou Villas Limited, Julius Opio, arrived to clear the land. The visit today coming days after Nairobi County officials brought down a gate and a wall that had been erected to block access to the property, according to Opio. Justin Ngugi and his partners, all residents of Oryx Villa, have for the last one month been using police to frustrate his efforts to access and develop the land which he claims to own. We have the title deed to this property and uh, we've applied to the county government. We followed the law and we'd like to develop the uh, property. Justin Ngugi and his partners who bought the land in 2008 claim they are the rightful owners of the property and that they suspect the former owner is trying to grab a section that was set aside for sewage. Whoever sold us this house is called Fred Rabongo. Okay? Rabongo and Patricia and uh, Guanzu is one of the same person. He is supposed to amalgamate that sewer. That's a sewer. That plot you are looking for there is a sewer. So what he is trying to do is to cut off this road and access that that plot on the other side and then build other things. Others we have all the documents, they're here, including occupation certificate. Opio's lawyer Roy Ford Mwenda, however, dismissed the claims by the judge and his team. What a certificate of occupation does, it proves the integrity of a building. And nowhere in the world has a certificate of occupation been used as a legal title to any property. For now, Guanzu Villas Limited workers have been allowed to clear the rubble and close the road before construction begins.